does phase three address fitness? Um, yeah, I think I think it's easy to say from the get, from the beginning. I mean, one of the first that's the first phase, is is the physical applications of, of of your martial arts, and that's one of the first things we get to see is people's transformations physically. Um, one one of my favorite stories is there was a lady who uh, came into my school, um, a really unlikely candidate for being a kickboxer. It, she was she was pretty overweight. Um, and one of the things she wanted to do was to be a competitor. And it's not my job to pass any judgment one way or another. It's my job to actually be a servant to these people when they come in. It's how can I help you? Um, and so my recommendation was, hey, we got to start by losing 100 pounds. Uh, that was 120 pounds ago. This lady trains minimum eight times a week. She is on the mat all the time. She will not quit, regardless of injuries, regardless of energy, regardless. And, you know, I've seen her laugh. I've seen her cry. I've seen her bleed. And this is a woman who's getting in shape. She, you know, I just weighed her in. She lost another four pounds last week alone. It's, it's an amazing thing that can happen if you're willing to apply yourself. Um, we have we have the facility, we have the means, we have the heart, we have the desire. All we need is people to come in and want to be a part of it. Does it address fitness? 100% it does. That's one of the first things you get to see.